Hi guys, it's me. I look terrible. It was raining and my hair's growing back all kinds of wiry. Anyway, I'm gonna show you how to do the uh, sanitization disinfection of the clubhouse here at Concord Station. Uh, really quick, as fast as I can so you're not bored. <clears throat> I've got that bucket. <clears throat> Put about two or three inches of water in there. I put one cap of the 3M quad disinfection, quad disinfection, and I have about four microfiber towels, which will give you eight surfaces each. They're already folded. They're in the water. <clears throat> the hardest part about doing this is going to be the handheld weights over here. So. You don't want to squeeze it too tight, you want to leave it a little bit wet so that way um, it's wet for about 10 minutes, that's how the virus actually dies. So you take your, your thing here and you just go ahead and wipe. I don't know if you can see me, I hope you can. You just go ahead and wipe across, wetting down each of the handles and then we're going to turn them a little bit. No, we're not. We're just going to go underneath. Under, 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 under. See? Don't know if you can see me. I'm going under now. Under, under, under. Nice and wet. It's almost dripping. <clears throat> now I'm going across the bottom row. The rag is almost flipping around getting the underside too. And now back, going under, 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 each one. It's fairly easy. Just kind of like scoot it in there. That's not so bad. And that was one side of my club. So now I'm gonna use the other side. <clears throat> that task was done. So now I'm just gonna go around. I'm going to wipe down every single one of the touch spots, like that there, and any place that people are at. See, nice and wet. That will be the disinfecting there. That should be good there. Nobody's really touching any of these other surfaces. They might lean. <clears throat> Oop, not too wet. Like it there. Here's a little touch spot. Like that. <coughs> Excuse me. Right there. Door handles. Still kind of really wet around there. Oop, don't let it drip. So there's one machine. There's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13 machines that we do everything I just showed you. I'm going to flip over my, because I use both sides of these rags now, and I'm going to flip it over. And now I'm using these two sides. This whole little, whole little area there. Crash bar. The whole crash bar really well. This here. That. Now I'm going to use the other side of this. This side. Light switch. This push button. Don't push it too hard. You'll open it. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah. Uh. I'm going to ask them, do, you, do they want us to wipe down the whole ball? I guess so, yes. We're going to have to do the whole ball. That'll be a task. Alright, we're going to clean these little balls here, these big balls. We've got big balls. <laughs> so, take down your ball. Take a new rag. We've got eight surfaces per rag, so we have at least, we'll need at least 
one whole but we'll have, there's no sides to a ball I don't know why I'm trying to figure that out but I don't know if you can see me I had it down on the thing you just kind of like wipe the whole thing and then turn it over wipe the other whole thing the whole ball and nothing but the ball so there's one and now I'm gonna flip it over. Ooh, that was dirty. I'm gonna flip it over, use the second, second side of this cloth. And I use these lines to guide me so I know where I left off. Ooh, that's a bigger circumference. So it's a bigger motion. Now I'm gonna flip it over. I did half the ball. There. <clears throat> Training videos on how to clean a ball. Okay, that's two sides. Now I'm going to flip it over and just open it up actually to flip it over. Those were some dirty balls. We're going to take care of that. Whoo, Nelly, this is a big ball. At least my training video is somewhat entertaining. Oh, this is a big ball. This is like Jupiter. Gotta keep going now. All the way around, all the way around, all the way around. Now turn it around. Oh, there. Again. Last one. That's okay. I could use the the prop or the whatever. Yeah, I'm propping it up so it's a prop. <laughs> okay, all three balls are done. Just just the way I did it. There's no easy way. You just have to like hold it up, like right about here, go around to the whole half, and then turn it around and. <clears throat> do the other half so thank you okay I used <clears throat> a whole rag I've done all of those with the first four sides and I flipped it over and I did the three balls with the other four sides now I'm gonna take another clean folded towel gently wring it you don't want to wring it too tight because you got to get that get all of these pieces of equipment done with a wetness. So we're gonna do these handles, nice and wet. Oh, we're gonna have to walk around and do the other side. I'm gonna do all of the places that people would even touch with their butt. <laughs> uh, these straps. Into these straps, nice and wet. Um, yeesh. Just gently do that, gently. And then this, of course, both sides. They might lean there. All right, this is really important. This right here, people really hold on to these. My goodness, I hope it doesn't turn on. <laughs> water holders water bottle holders oh you know what that is too that's for putting your elbow in leaning I imagine and then these and there now I'm gonna flip to the other side and I'm gonna do that just wiping it all down these equipments were designed for cleaning these equipments. <laughs> Where did I go to school? All right, there's the one. Okay, time to flip. Well, not really. I could have used it some more. But yes, basically, in, out. 
hope I'm doing a good job of videoing. I hope you can see I'm doing kind of lost control over what side the rag is on. But I know I haven't flipped it over, so it's good. Okay, treadmill number three. Top, sides, over, top. Get inside this elbow thing. This is where you keep your cell phone, I'm assuming. <laughs> you can plug it in right there. It's kind of cool. And now I'm going to flip it over completely. Because... Because... You're supposed to. Alright, now we're on the inside. Oh, I can't believe how bad I look. <laughs> Cheese. <clears throat> Clean that really nice. Clean that really nice. All right, and what do we have here? An elliptical. We don't have to do the feet. People aren't touching the feet. But it's very important to get all of the touchable surfaces. You know what, I'm probably going to take the rags after I've finished wiping all of the hand touch spots. I think I'm gonna go back with the remaining rags and brush these off just to be professional. Okay. Just keep flipping that rag. I'm not the greatest videographer, videographer. I'm gonna step on here and hold on. Uh oh, Lord, help me. Oh, Cause I'm kind of short. And I'm gonna cut the video now because it's a very long video. It'll probably take too long to load, so you get the gist. You just wipe all of the surfaces with all of your rags. You have eight surfaces of your rags to do all of this. So that's 32 sides. You could get it done. Thank you so much for some important key factors about disinfecting. <clears throat> You never want to return your dirty rag into the bowl. Keep your dirty rags out of there. It's clean rags only. Also, when you're wiping, I've already mentioned a couple of times to keep the rag pretty, pretty wet. Not dripping, but just above dripping. And when you're wiping the surfaces, you want to make sure that you're really getting the whole surface. Try not to like scribble. We want to do like a nice uniform stroke so that it looks professional. And don't forget to get underneath. A lot of people forget to do this. We're not just doing this to do it. We're doing this to really help prevent the spread. We're doing a good deed because we love our fellow citizens and we also don't want to die ourselves. We don't want to get sick and drown to death in our own fluid. So, full uniform strokes. Never return the rag to the bucket. Keep them out and get the whole surface. Thank you. Okay, I've come across an interesting machine. It's not really interesting, it's pretty common sense, but some of the things, just to be clear, I wanted to show you a couple of things. Can you see me? There's a lot of handles on this machine. We got this pull-up bar. I've already done it, I'm gonna do it over just to show you. You wanna like soap, anything they touch. I can't reach that, I'm gonna need to 
get a tool and get up there, but don't forget that one. And look at all of these. And down there. I don't know if you can see that. But I'll show it to you. And then these pins. Down here at the bottom of every machine, people put the weights, so they always touch these. So it's very important to put your pin, to, to just at least clean the handle of the pin. And I, <laughs> I have uh, screwed myself by taking it out. It's going to be right there. Um, <clears throat> these, these are pieces that they use for certain other exercises, so don't forget every little handle. There's two. There's a third one down here. You just want to like hit it real good. It doesn't take much. There's one here. Get the handle really good. And then what are you going to do with these cloth straps? You're going to wipe them. I know it sounds crazy, but soak those bad boys. Kill these viruses. We're doing a good deed. So just grab them and pull them like that. Pull it down the strap. That's, you know, you have to clean the straps on a baby diaper changing table anyway. That's how we do it. And these ropes, same thing. You just pull the ropes up and down, soaking it up real good. And then any, again, any pins that you find, any knobs that you have, like they're blue, any handles at all. There's a lot. So we'll look around for all the things that people would touch. Get them good. Let's kill this coronavirus. I'm a bad videographer. Oh, come on. It's hard to do with the glove. I'd like to add to my last video. I'd like to add that earlier I said that we didn't have to do these steps. But now that I'm into it, I realize it's really important to be a professional. So, you know, you're coming in here, you're working out, you're paying a lot of money to use this facility and the, and the, and the bottom is filthy. So, I have found that it's not taking that much time at all. So, please, let's wipe these out. Just real quick. I mean, after today, because I don't think they were done yet. Because it's, it's pretty dusty, look. It's, it's pretty dusty, um, unless that's just the haze. I can't really see, oh yeah, it's pretty dusty. There's a lot of, like, stuff. See, it wiped right off. So just, if you don't mind, because we, we have a name to keep. So, gotta make sure. Thank you.